Migration Flash to HTML5 in Forge of Empires. The game Forge of Empires was developed by InnoGames based on a technology named Flash. This technology has some shortcomings and the product's end of life has been announced by its vendor Adobe. Software based on Flash will not be usable very long if not changed. This caused some uncertainty in the community. Will this be the end of Forge of Empires? InnoGames provides a very clear statement for this. InnoGames warns that Forge of Empires will continue to grow and remain available for many more years. To achieve that, InnoGames plans for the first half of 2018 to publish an HTML5 based version. This is two years before the announced end of Flash. The future of this game is secured. For all those who are confused by these terms, hear a bit background information. Adobe Flash is a platform for software development and presentation of multimedia and interactive content. Flash enables developers to present, animate and manipulate vector graphics, pixel graphics and video clips. It is a software that needs to be installed in addition to the browser to be executed automatically by the browser when needed. The free of charge Flash Player is the most used web browser plugin and available for nearly all desktop operation systems. In March 2016, a study came to the result that every 11th website used Flash. Without Flash, programmers only could use the animated GIF format to provide animated pictures in a resource-efficient way. But the GIF technology has a lot of technical restrictions. This is only one of many fields where Flash opened new possibilities to software developers. Especially these possibilities make games so much more attractive. Due to the wide spreading in the market, the Flash Player became a popular target for hackers. In early 2015, twice in a row, people became aware of security weaknesses without having a patch from Adobe to fix it. The risk was rated so high that many publishers and browser manufacturers recommended to deactivate Flash immediately. Some even blocked Flash automatically. The motivation of a manufacturer to maintain an end-of-life product is limited. Therefore, InnoGames had to react. The migration to HTML5 is significant and has a huge impact on the part of the software executed on a player's computer. The migration requires relevant software changes and testing, also because Forge of Empires became a very big game in the past years. So, InnoGames decided to use a time frame of more than one year for this huge project. This is a good prerequisite that we, the players, will not notice much from that transition. Our game will be updated one day next year and continue as before. But more stable and secure, because without flash problems and security risks.